Speak to the World project's aim was to gain our views as children and young people on being involved in the decision-making process of Europe and internationally. From November 2010 to February 2011, approximately 500 young people and children took part in consultation events all across Europe. There they discussed their views and opinions on being heard and being taken seriously by European decision makers. Countries included in these consultation events were England, Romania, Austria, Estonia and Ireland, with help and input from Moldova and Russia. Hi. Hello. Hello. Buna. Russia. Buna. Tere. Guten Tag. Tabus. European government and institutions agree, on paper, that they must make sure children and young people can and do participate in their decision-making processes. However, in practice, this is not always the case. This project's purpose was to learn from children and young people's experiences how well the right to be heard and taken seriously is really working today. But why was the project needed? Trebuie să aflăm mai multe despre procesul de luare a deciziilor. To have our views as children and young people heard. Last week was all the decisions about the cause of the traffic was very stressful to the longest time itself. We explored reasons why we aren't involved. This question did not come to our attention. Why do we think that we are not involved? The information is not accessible. Sogar wenn wir fragen, hören sie uns nicht zu. Love? Yeah, I'm in the shopping center. Yeah. There is not enough emphasis on active participation at school level and other young people and children's organizations. Often educational institutions don't inform us of European matters. These were just some of the reasons from the project. We want to be involved in the political game. Aber wir wissen nicht, wie wir die Barriere überwinden können. The role of the internet and social networking sites were discussed a great deal by children and young people. However, at present, we feel that we do not gain much information from them. It is non-governmental organisations, youth organisations, including child-led organisations, that are crucial in bringing children and young people's voices to the decision-making process. We were asked, do we actually want to be involved in European issues? The answer was a firm, yes! Not many of us have experience of being involved. Some of us have participated in local, provincial or national processes, but not European. Peagu kõik meist tahtsid osaleda Euroopa ja rahvusvaheliste otsuste tegemises. Mõned eelistasid, et neid esindataks, et selle asa meil et endise esindada. We believe we know what's best for us. Having views and solutions that are fresh and new, which can challenge the fixed attitudes of adults. Suntem preocupați să creăm o lume mai bună pentru viitor, mai preocupați decât mulți adulți și credem că putem contribui cu idei și soluții la procesul de luare a deciziilor. So we have to be involved. So we think some of our recommendations for change are Was getan werden muss ist Bridge the gap between decision-making institutions and children and young people. Machen Sie es für Kinder einfacher, Ihre Ideen und Lösungen einzubringen und nehmen Sie sie ernst. Von vaja rohkem pühendumist koolide ja ülikoolide poolt. Von guna tetsile on kredeli ka peilor, sitinerilor, ja nii üsesin organisatsi ja asfel ümkõt, sest sinde ka siis on laatsin konsiderar. Tuleb välja selgipida takistused ja eemaldada kõik piirangud, et kaasa saaksid tuula kõik noored. Polusire on neid metode, siis utilizare on nüüd vast pied ennast. Adults must show young people that their roles will not be tokenistic. To show us the results and that we are valued.
Children do see things differently. We need to be involved in the decision-making process. We hope and trust that you realise that decisions are only good and legitimate if we, children and young people, have been involved in the decision-making process.